I will be loyal to the motherland and the people. I will accept the supervision of the people. In 2018, Xi Jinping pushed for a change in constitution. He is no longer subject to the two-term limit imposed on his predecessors. He can now be president for life. His main rivals have been purged in highly choreographed trials, clearing the path for him to stay in power as General Secretary of the Communist Party. He'll also keep the crucial title of Chairman of the Central Military Commission. So what's really at stake in this 20th Party Congress? Well, there's always more power to consolidate, and Xi needs to place his closest allies next to him at the top. Finding out who joined and left the top decision-making bodies like the Standing Committee will be crucial. Well, some names can already be heard resonating in the halls of power. Xi Jinping loyalists, mostly, who one day perhaps will succeed him. But also the rising star of a rival faction, Vice Premier Hu Chunhua. Xi Jinping has to ensure the various clans inside the party pledge him allegiance. The Communist Youth League faction, the reformers, and those loyal to 96-year-old former President Jiang Zemin, who still casts a long shadow over Chinese politics. Well, Xi Jinping made many enemies over the years, but he so far managed to keep them at bay, whether by negotiation or force. Well, those were the political stakes for Xi Jinping, but what about for China as a whole? We'll talk about the challenges awaiting Xi's China in the next video.